Hi, this is my room from a different angle. See, normally I'm sitting here, but I just went like this, and doesn't it feel like we're in a totally different place? Well, that leads me to the point of today's vlog, which is that backgrounds are huge. I get a lot of questions about how to make videos, and, and how I make videos, and how to make good videos. Backgrounds are huge! You gotta have a cool background to make a cool video. That's just the way it goes. And it's part of what makes a YouTube video a good YouTube video. Which brings me to answer number two in how do you make good YouTube videos. You gotta use some lighting! So right now, what I have to use to light me, this thing right here, called the China light. Very, 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 very cool light to have because it's a really soft light when it shines on something. When it shines on something, it makes it look nice and soft. And you can get those at Ikea. And I, I would say somewhere else right now. It sounded like I was going to say you can get those at Ikea or Walmart. I, I, you can get them at Ikea. Feels good. Feels really nice. Do you see how I turned that light off? The background gets kind of boring looking. I have another light that is shining on the background. You know, and I got these wacky drawings and stuff. There's my two pieces of advice on how to make a cool YouTube video. Light it well and get a cool background. And you're on your way. So, let's open up a piece of viewer mail. Viewer mail, viewer mail, let's see what we got today in the viewer mail. This comes to us from Melody in Rankin, Pennsylvania. Melody writes, my handwriting is terrible. My name is Melody. Melody, my handwriting is horrible. Terrible! It's the worst! When I write stuff still, now I feel embarrassed. I feel like I write like a six-year-old child. So don't worry about it. Having good handwriting is not the most important thing in the world. This comes to us from Ted in Ben... No, that's a road. Ted in Toledo, Ohio. I would say something about Toledo, Ohio, but I don't think I've ever been there. I've been to Des Moines? No, that's Iowa. Ted writes... Very small. You may have heard from me before. Sorry to bother you so much. You're not bothering me, dog. You can write anytime. I have a great idea for rap battles, Batman versus Superman. It's a pretty interesting idea, Ted. They're both superheroes, which is both good and bad thing, but they're both like pretty epic superheroes. Almost historical figures. Ted, that's not a bad idea. I'm gonna give that some serious thought. Not promising I'll make it, but I'm gonna give that some serious thought. Next piece comes to us from Pearl in Orlando, Florida. Hi Pearl, I'm coming to Orlando, Florida. Play a show if you wanna go. It's called Playlist Live. I'll put some information in the thing. Pearl writes, hey nice Peter, you're the best. Thanks, Pearl. I like your videos, and you never cease to make me smile. I love the way you use the word cease. You know, you don't see that that much. Hope you like my picture. I do! Turtles are my favorite. Mine too! This next one comes to us from Maddie in Muskegon, Michigan. Oh man, that's like the really cold part of Michigan, isn't it? And that's the part that's like up here or something. Michigan people always, they always want to show you their palms. Oh, you're from Michigan? Yeah, I didn't know. I didn't ask where on your palms. Just, just making conversation. Maddie writes, you rock, Peter! Right on, Maddie! Oh yeah, dude, that is awesome! A lot of people have been talking about street music and asking me about it, and they're asking, are there going to be more street music? Are you ever going to make more street music? Of course I am. And of course me and Cassim G are. It's just one of those things we wanted to give it time to, to breathe, man. Superman Socks kind of completed a chapter in street music, but that doesn't mean we won't bring it back. Uh, I have no idea when, but we're actually meeting about it next week. So we're going to talk about it and see what we want to do next. So, this is awesome. I love Love the suspenders. This next and final piece of viewer mail comes to us from Tristan in Atlanta, Georgia. I got a playing card. It's a, oh, it's all decked out. I was expecting just a playing card. And then, yeah, dog, it's the Ace of Peter. That's awesome. How do you, that's amazing. Who is my role model? Uh, that's a really interesting question. Who's my role model? Everybody. Because everybody has some kind of cool thing that you can learn from. Everybody can be a role model in a way, even people that aren't cool. You'd be like, wow, that's not cool. I should learn how to not do that. You know? So, yeah, that's my answer. Everyone. Everyone's my role model. Uh, who's yours? That concludes this week's episode of Viewer Mail. I've got another special video coming later this week. Uh, me and Dante were coming up with a song. We couldn't finish it. And instead of trying to finish it ourselves, we were like, what if we let the audience finish it? So look out for that later this week. And good luck with everything that you do. And have a wonderful week. And I'll see you next Monday. Bye! I'm about to eat this One, camera. Two, ah! three. It's Monday. Badoop, doop, doobie doop. Monday. Badoop, doop, doobie doop. Yeah. And now, a very short song about this Darth Vader guitar pick. One, two, three. I'm so glad I've got you with me today. I know I could lose you tomorrow anyway It's not what you have It's what you've been So let it in and Pack light, carry